Hi, Ms. Navarre students. Ms. Navarre here. I just wanted to uh, read a book or two that I have on this week's topic, construction working and simple machines. Um, I hope you are all staying warm and I hope you enjoy my read alouds just like if, if, as if we were in the classroom. So our first book is called Moving Machines, Construction Forces, and the author is Patty Whitehouse. And remember that the author writes the words. And our illustrator will be a photographer, as, as you can tell from the front. These are pictures of real life um, construction machines. Construction site machines. This is a construction site. There are many machines here. Some machines move. Machines that move can help build or tear down. Machines for moving. The ramp and shovel are machines too. They are called simple machines. They do not have any parts that move, but they make moving things easier. This shovel moves dirt. Moving on a ramp. A wheelbarrow is moving up the ramp. A ramp is a machine that makes moving up or down easier. A cement chute is a ramp too. It moves cements down it moves to cement down to the right place. You would find those on a cement truck. Or in cement. Moving on a pulley. Workers are moving a bucket. They are using a pulley. Pulleys help move, th move heavy things. This machine is a crane. It is a big pulley. It moves big things. So the crane is helping lift part of the frame onto the top of the building or the house or apartment. Moving with shovels and scoops. Workers are moving dirt with a shovel. A shovel is a machine called a lever. Winston. Sorry guys. Say hi Winston. And here's Max, my other dog, just in case you're wondering what that noise is. The scoop of a bulldozer is a lever too. It helps move big piles of dirt. Moving on wheels. Many machines have, many machines move on wheels. Each pair of wheels is on an axle. So you see here's the two wheels and there's the axle that keeps them connected. A steamroller is a machine with big wide with a big wide wheel. It moves, it makes dirt very flat. So it's kind of like a rolling pin when you're rolling out dough. Moving up and down. A well driller moves up and down. It pushes a giant drill bit into the ground. A jackhammer moves much faster than a wheel, a well driller. It has a pointed end and it breaks things apart. So like when people want to break concrete, they use a driller, a well driller. Excuse me, not a well driller, a jackhammer. Moving people. A scissor lift holds people who are working on the building. Lifts move people up and down. A cherry picker can move workers up and down too. The arm of the cherry picker is a level, is a level, or the arm of the cherry picker is a level, leveler. And you see why Ms. Navarre doesn't work in construction. Moving a machine. Some machines are used to move other machines. This dirt mover is being moved to a new job. Big machines are needed to move other machines around a work site. So like if you're driving down the highway and you see a big 18 wheeler with, with a dirt mover or a backhoe or a, um, 
or a big dumpster because they also need dumpsters at work sites. Try it, make a steamroller with a can. Now you can make clay very flat. Like Miss Navarre said earlier, you can also use a rolling pin with like some Play-Doh or some like pie dough or pizza crust. The end. Now for Miss Navarre's second book, this one's shorter. This is called Machines Big and Small. And this one also does not have an illustrator as they are real pictures, but our author is Ted Schaefer. Large and, sm large and small machines are working. They are making a new road where the old road used to be. While the machines work, people help direct traffic. They hold a sign that says stop when they need the traffic to stop. They turn the signal around to say go when it is safe for traffic to pass. Kind of like at, when, at, like at our school, we have a crossing guard that tells us when it's safe to cross and when it's not and help people get from one side of the road to the other. Bulldozers can push the old road into piles. Graders pull flat dirt and smooth. So a grader pulls dirt flat and smooths it out. Loaders with buckets lift the pieces of the old road. Then they dump the pieces into a dump truck. Another big piece of machinery you can see around town, dump trucks. The dump trucks haul the broken road to a place where it can be used for another purpose. So we're recycling. Front loaders bring stone for the new road. They can also use gravel or, you know, we can also, we can also have a, like a, we can also use a concrete for the road. The machines can move quickly or slowly. Heavy rollers flatten the dirt. Some machines are noisy. Some machines work more quietly. Machines start each day nice and clean, but at the end of every day, they need a bath, just like we do. We take baths to get our bodies clean. Some take them in the morning, some take them in the after or evening before they go to bed, and some take two a day. And that is the end of our story. Well guys, we hope, or I hope to see you soon. If you need any help with anything, just reach out to me on Dojo. And like I said, and hopefully the plan is we will see you in face-to-face -face on Monday. Bye.